Hello everyone, Jack here, and today we're going to take a look at connecting a 32x32 32 32 RGB matrix to the Papilio boards. Um, now we've ported the Smart Matrix library to uh, the Papilio to, de to Design Lab, and we've also made a special VHDL uh, controller that allows us to uh, use these matrix displays with the Papilio board with uh, very little fuss. So uh, let's get started and take a look at what we need to do to connect this to a Papilio board. So you'll see there's two connections on the back of the matrix. There's a power, and uh, if you're going to be driving these at full uh, brightness, then you're going to want to connect a 2 amp power supply using these spade connectors. But what we found is that if you uh, lower the brightness, you know, 30%, 15%, then the Papilio has more than enough power to supply uh, the needs. So we just go ahead and connect a couple wires to this connector, and we're going to connect it to the 5 volt and ground on the Papilio. So this is a Papilio Duo, and on the wing uh, connectors, the lowest power pin is always ground, and the highest power pin is 5 volts. So we just connect it like that. Okay, then the other connection we have is the input, and we connect this to uh, the wing that we've made, which is an RGB uh, LCD panel wing. And for all the sketches, the circuit that we've built for the Papilio Duo, we need to connect this wing to wing slot D. So we'll just go ahead and plug this in like that and also you need to be careful uh, with these spade connectors they can short and cause uh, a, a short and uh, ruin your panel so you either want to tuck them away somewhere or the best thing is to um, put some electrical tape on them okay and then the final thing is we're going to plug in the papilio board Let's go ahead and just set this up like this. All right, so now to the software. Uh, for, uh, you wanna open up Design Lab and you'll go to File and then Examples and you'll wanna scroll down and find the Smart Matrix 32 by 32 and there's several Example sketches, this does animated GIFs, bitmaps, shows all the features, and then this is one pixel Pac-Man. So for this one, we've got, uh, we're gonna do the demo that shows all the features. So uh, we could take a look at the circuit here by clicking on view circuit. And what we see that we have here is we have a ZPU Eno soft processor, uh, and we've connected uh, the panel driver to wishbone slot eight and then that goes to the matrix wing, which if we scroll in here, uh, hold on. Sorry, this is a little awkward, but uh, you can't really see it, but that's uh, wing slot D. Okay, so let's go back to our schematic, or I'm sorry, to design lab. And the first thing we need to do is we need to load the circuit. So we'll click on that. Down here we should see it's loading this, and here you can see that RGB matrix is a circuit it's loading, uh, and we can see it's loading it to it. Okay, it's completed, so now the next thing we need to do is load the sketch. We're going to click Upload. We should see it's compiling, and then it should load. Okay, so completed. Now if we look at our matrix, uh, we see it going through the feature demo. So I'll let this play for a little while. And uh, the further away you get from it, the easier it is to see.
All right, so uh, that pretty much covers it.